So starting off with a plant pot. So this is going to be for the gerbils cage area and they'll be able to sleep in it. Next we have some toilet paper tubes. These are the only ones I have at the moment but that will be enough for about a week. Then I have these lovely gerbil berry flavoured drops. They like they snuffle them up apparently. And these are what they look like. They're like really tiny little like they're a bit like chocolate buttons. So yeah, they like eat them. Then I have like chopped up finely pieces of cardboard. A berry nut circular feed. An apple and berry feed. And um, stuff to feed them with. So like measuring spoons. Then I have a shreddies half cut box. A little underground wooden house that I made myself. They're going to chew this up but it's what it was made for so yeah. Um, a feeding cup that's free from Pets at Home. I really do recommend getting one of these. Um, they're supposed to be really really good and yeah. So I also got some shells at like this car boot sale fate I went to and they're only 50p each but I'm not sure I'm going to put them in the cage because they might break. Then I got these from a christening I went to and they're like flowers, they're like um, sugar paper. So yeah, definitely be feeding them for that will be like one of their beddings for a week. Um, a small little like fish bowl kind of thing that I was going to use for a sand bath, but it's going to be too small, so it'll be like a little hidey hut. Now this is the rest of the cardboard shoe box. I used. You can have like different places, like you can have like that. You can have loads of different combinations, so I thought that was really cool. And if you have a special box, then you might as well do it because I do recommend it. Then I have the rest of the shreddy box, and it's got like Brussels on it and um, spiky stuff for them to go through, but it won't hurt them. Chocolate orange box. This is supposed to be really good because they have loads of different holes in, and make sure that it's got no chocolate on it. Otherwise, that could kill them. Then I have these just um, little, well, they're not little, they're quite big. They're like, that's a cat bowl. But I thought that for four gerbils, that would be big. And then I also got a pooper scooper just to sieve through their bedding once in and um, now and then because just to like change the freshness up of it. Then I just have another toilet tube and this is the last thing a massive box of cardboard paper just little things that they can chew on through the years that I have them and yeah thank you for watching goodbye